Welcome back to the channel. So I've got something very exciting for you guys here today. I have Revenant Reborn. Before we get into it, guys, hit that subscribe button to stay up to date on the latest Overwatch 2 news, as well as Apex Legends. It's like the new tattoo. It's pretty sick. It's from uh, Near Automatics. It could be his uh, dress design. Oh my shit, that's a moth. But yet, let's get right into it. Throw a hold on me because I'm a little cold. But yet, this is Revenant Reborn. He looks so fucking cool. I love the look of him. Now, that's not me saying I prefer this uh, look over... Um, but I am saying I do uh, actually like it. It's pretty good. Uh, I, do, I do think it's pretty sick. Uh, so if you guys, I'm not gonna go over here, but uh, like how this is all happening um, and stuff. Uh, if you guys want to figure that out, um, you can go watch the kill code on the Apex YouTube channel. Uh, it's two episodes out of it right now, and some in-game stuff that you guys can go play to uh, bridge gaps in the story. It is so sick. I highly recommend you go check it out. And the animation is really good. It is like top tier. Apex have mostly, you know, always had good animation with their cinematics, and um, so yeah, animation is, it's there, it's, it's good. Um, but his, uh, his new look, I, I quite like it, I know, um, of some people who don't like it, for the likes of, I'm going to say, uh, my friend doesn't like it, he thinks, well, I don't know if he likes it, I'm gonna ask him, do you, uh, I've got a question, do you like, uh, Revenant's new design? Yo, what is up guys? Today I'm gonna be talking about Revenant's new design. Yeah, dude. Yeah, okay, good, thanks. Yeah, uh, never mind, he does actually like it. Uh, my uh, girlfriend doesn't like it, she, um, she's kind of given an open apex. Uh, uh, quite sad to say, but they took her favourite mode out, her arenas, so she doesn't really. But yeah, uh, yeah, I like it, I really do like it, he looks sick. Um, I like the, the lore behind it, I like how Revenant is now acting in-game. All the stuff happening in game right now is super sick, um, and it's it's giving me hype, the same level of hype from uh, season four when that cinematic first dropped with with Revenant killing Loba's parents. It was divine, absolutely. Mwah. Um, and I've seen a lot of people also go on the same thing that it is the same type of you know energy because Revenant he's an amazing character. He's the best in that game. I'm going to say. Um, and it's he's so well done, he's so well written, um, he's so cool. It's just and I like how in Kill Code they show him being this ruthless. You know, I'm looking for a word here. He's, he's they show him being ruthless, but also an expert in killing people. You know, he he um he doesn't struggle to kill anyone. He like takes on three guys at once. Man, it's he's insane. He's absolutely insane. We actually have his abilities now for his rework, so he's not only getting a new look, but he is also getting a rework, different abilities, new kit, it's amazing. So, starting off with his passive Assassin's Instinct, he's got the same fast crawl and wall climbing, um, you know, extended wall climb he has uh, right now, um, uh, because they're going to keep that in because it's, you know, it fits his character, it's iconic for him. Um, so they're keeping that in his kit. But his passive also now includes uh, seeing nearby enemies who are low on health. Um, and if he himself gets them to low health, he will reveal that enemy to his team. Shadow Pounce, uh, it can be used to close long distances. Now this is his tactical ability. It can be charged for longer distances and can also be used to jump onto walls to, you know, gain extra height so yeah really cool giving uh revenant a lot more mobility making him a lot scarier if i'm being honest um not only can he now reveal you to his team he can pounce on you from a distance and really fuck you up especially when he's using his brand new ultimate forge shadows now what this does this kind of forms a protective barrier over revenant um, of, sh of, sh of shadows pretty much this blocks and um, bullets for a time being and uh, it's got 75 health if i'm uh, remembering that correctly it does not block uh, damage such as uh, aoe damage like caustic gas or fire damage it doesn't block ring damage but it might block projectile damage so like grenades and um, so what happens is this sh veil of sh uh, shadows kind of forms over his body and protects a uh, creates a protective barrier 
and um, that you know blocks bullets but it can be destroyed obviously when 75 health runs out um, but as soon as it runs out it will have a timer that will start to recharge his shields for the duration of the ultimate if you shot though the timer will stop he also will gain a bigger upper hitbox um, when using this just to make him a little easier to hit to kind of combat um, this you know preventing damage to him for a brief period of time not even a brief period of time actually a pretty decent bit of time um because you know you need the 75 damage to actually get rid of it so it's going to be uh quite strong i believe so his upper hitbox will be uh made bigger during his ultimate but if revenant manages to get a knock during his ultimate it will instantly refill his shield and it will also extend the timer of his ultimate up until the um max the timer starts at so it won't go higher than the time it started at same way uh bloodhound's ultimate works when he gets knocks he his timer recharges but yeah that's um really all i have for, for you guys here today uh just my final thoughts on it. i'm really excited for this it's great uh, i'm so hyped for the next season of apex i'm getting stuck right stuck right back into it gameplay trailer revealing uh today as i'm filming this because it's uh whatever um, so I'll probably have a video up on that tomorrow, so that'll be out today, you guys probably watch it and then. But yeah, I'm really looking forward to this, I like uh, his new look, um, and I'm I'm dead excited for it, I'm actually dead excited for it. And I hope you guys are too, um, and if you did enjoy the video, uh, a, like, I'll be, a like would be greatly appreciated, and please hit that subscribe button, it's the best way to support the channel if you did enjoy the videos. I messed up my entire outro, my flow was completely off, sorry. But yeah, uh, hit that subscribe and stay up to the latest uh, Apex Legends and Overwatch 2 news. It's the best way to support the channel. Check out my social media, my TikTok, my Instagram, and my Twitter. Um, but yeah, that's all I gotta say. See ya.